Hi, I'm Dr. Manmohan Singh Bedi. I'm a surgical gastroenterologist who deals with the surgical aspect of the diseases of the digestive system and uh, I deal with obesity too. Today, I'll be talking about a very common problem which we face routinely that is jaundice. Jaundice is pilia in uh, uh, Hindi or Punjabi as we commonly know as. It, it can be caused by the diseases of the liver, of the bile, the uh, biliary tract. Biliary tract is the sort of pipe system which goes from the which take the juice that is bile from the liver into the intestine or it can be due to the diseases uh, of the pancreas. Now it, in the diseases of liver it can most commonly it is due to the hepatitis that is infection by some virus or some bacteria rarely by bacteria. Uh, no, very commonly it is hepatitis A due to uh, consumption of uh, contaminated water or contaminated food or by hepatitis B or C which are blood borne same transmission as we know it is uh, by sharing the syringes or having a sexual contact with infected person. Hepatitis A is harmless and usually the disease subsides in no time but for uh, hepatitis B and C it has a long term effect and uh, they are required treatment for the long term. Then the jaundice can also be caused due to the diseases of gallbladder, gallstones very common problem these days and uh, when the stone slips from gallbladder into the bile duct that is a drainage system it can again obstruct the system and can cause jaundice. It can also be due to the tumors or some other infections of the gallbladder or the biliary system. Then the third is due to the disease of pancreas which can again be due to infection or stones, pancreas stones or due to the uh, tumors of the pancreas very commonly. Now for tumor related thing or a stone related thing the answer usually is surgery but for the bile duct stones and sometimes pancreatic stones the endotherapy and that is endoscopic treatment can be given and usually for bile duct stone endoscopic treatment is very successful and in case they fail then we jump in and do a laparoscopic surgery for bile duct stones so the assessment of a patient of jaundice is must to rule out the cause because we usually go to the papas and uh, coax and to get the medicine and by the time patient lands up with us it's usually very late and disease is incurable or it can cause a liver failure also. So that is all about jaundice. Now uh, I am a surgical gastroenterologist, a new, uh, a newest branch in the uh, gastro or uh, surgical branch. Uh, how we are different from others, I am a counterpart of a medical gastroenterologist which deal on the surgical aspect of gastroenterology. How we are different from surgeons because they also operate, uh, general surgeons because they also operate upon uh, the you know uh, gallbladder and all that. We de deal with advanced cases like cancer of the gallbladder or complicated stone disease. So even uh, the cancer of esophagus or I, uh, esophagus, intestine, pancreas, liver. So we usually deal with these cancer specifically like super super specialization of the cancer of digestive diseases. Not only cancer but we also disease, diagnose and disease, uh, diagnose and treat the diseases related to digestive system. And uh, the common problem which we are facing these days that is obesity and we treat the obesity in various ways by dietary to uh, ranging from diet to you can say the surgical aspect of it and we deal with all the advanced uh, laparoscopic surgeries which we even a cancer surgeries for the uh, digestive system we do it by laparoscopy. So you can reach us on your website that is www. Uh, Dr. Bedi uh, hyphen gastrosurgeon.com or you can follow us on our Facebook page for an appointment 
and uh, you can reach us uh, reach out to us for any uh, simple or even a complicated uh, problems which you are having or you can look us on health thank you so much for your discussion